Hey everybody, welcome to Soda's Place. As you can see, I'm out in the wild. <laughs> Jeff and his son are fishing. And I brought the crochet, of course. I um, don't have my, dri my driver's, <laughs> my fishing license for Virginia. So I can't fish here. And um, I didn't pick one up, so, but maybe next time. Anyway, let me show what I'm working on. I am um, showing you where I'm at on my little, the pink bag from the Elspeth show. Um, let me show you how far I've gotten. Hold on. Bam. So this is, like this is the bottom, and this is how far I've gotten. And I've started on the next row of pink, because I'm going back to the dark pink. I don't have any light pink. I thought I did, but I don't know where it is. So I did the dark pink, the variegated, then I'm going back to the dark, then I'll go with the beige. Um, this one. And then I'll put the handle on. This is the picture. That is the inspiration for my little bag. That one is huge, but so this is just a mini version. And, um, but yeah. So I'm gonna work on this while they are fishing. I'm using a four millimeter hook. Yes, I said four. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? That's my name on it. <laughs> I wasn't prepared. I hadn't planned on going to go uh, with them because I was just gonna stay in the room, and you know, but um, I decided but I was asked to come, I'm like, sure. <laughs> and um, so I didn't have, I don't have my hat, my hat my friend Deb gave me, uh, made for me. <clears throat> I would love to have it right now because the sun, right now I'm under this thing, which there's a, it's covered, but over there where they're fishing, there's no shade and a hat would have been perfect, but I didn't bring it. <laughs> I'll have to, since she gave me two, I'll have to leave one in the car and um, that way I can always have it for surprise fishing trips. <laughs> Got on my shades. <laughs> so anyway, let's, um, let me see. I'm using this yarn here. And uh, it's all 100% cotton, mercerized cotton. And I've got bunches of it, so I'm gonna use it, try to use it up. So, I wanted to give you a quick update on how my bag is looking. I just have a few to uh, sew in or change colors, and uh, but it's coming together. And uh, I'll have to get some of these that are some bigger ones. So I thought these were bigger. <laughs> I didn't read the dimensions, <laughs> but these are at Amazon. I have a link in my little Amazon thing, and um, I try to put everything in that. If I if I have something and I show y'all, check the link in the Amazon thing because I probably put it in there <laughs> if you're interested in it. But, um, and then I did this little row. I wanted it to stick out a little bit to be a little different so you can see it better than just a single crochet. So it looks like this at first until I work back into it and then it looks like that just to give it a little bit more of a definition like that. Anyway, so I'm going to work on this while they are fishing. And uh, maybe I can get this whole row, of, next row of pink done while I'm here. And, uh, but yeah, I might go back to the car. But there's a little breeze going. So we shall see. <laughs> I'm just doing single crochets. So I want it to be tight. So it won't be, uh, you know, when you use it, it holds up. That's what I did with the other one and it's working out really good. This first row is hard to do after this uh, row of reverse single crochet. It's hard, not hard, just takes a little time to get under that stitch. But um, 
but there's only a couple of these rows, so it's not too bad. All right, y'all. <clears throat> I'll keep you updated on, um, you know, how it's coming along and such. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to you later and have a blessed day. Mm-hmm. <laughs>